Hi, welcome to the first of a series on using AI to help you speak English. The first site I'd like to introduce is Gliglish. Uh, Gliglish is free. Uh, they also have a paid version. The free version only allows you 10 minutes a day and up to 50 conversations. But actually, it's pretty good practice. Now, with Gliglish, you can not only practice English, but you can practice a bunch of other languages. Um, I practiced one or two other languages, and it was very good as well. Let's say you go into English. Uh, you, there are two ways you can do it. You can use the teacher mode where you just speak to the teacher and the teacher can uh, correct things for you or those kind of things. Or you can go into the role play mode. Let's just take a look at the teacher mode. Hey, I'm Gliglish. Let's practice your English. What would you like to talk about? Now you press this and then you just talk. Hi, Gliglish. I'd like to learn the best way to study English alone. Hello. I'd be happy to help you with that. When studying English alone, it's important to focus on various language skills. Have you considered practicing reading, writing, listening, and speaking? I've been trying to practice speaking as much as possible, but it's difficult because I don't have someone to talk to. I understand. Speaking practice is crucial for improving your English skills. While finding a language partner or joining a conversation group would be ideal, there are still ways to practice on your own. Now, you can even ask her to explain things for you. Like, what do you mean by crucial? I don't know that word. Oh, I apologize for using a word you're not familiar with. Crucial means extremely important or necessary. So, speaking practice is very important for improving your English skills. I hope that clarifies it for you. Can you give me an example of how you've been practicing speaking on your own? So anyway, you can go on like that for a while. You can also practice, like we said before, you can also practice uh, role plays. So let's try a role play. Imagine you're walking on a busy street and need assistance. You see someone nearby and decide to approach for help. Okay, I have to think of something to ask for help with. Or they give me some advice here. Let me try one of those. Excuse me, would you mind helping me with something? Of course. What do you need help with? And now they give you other things you can ask about. So maybe the train station. I seem to be lost. I can't find the train station. Can you tell me where it is? Sure. It's just a few blocks away from here. Take a left at the next traffic lights, then walk straight for about five minutes. You'll see the train station. So, as you can see, Gliglish will help you with speaking. Uh, you can talk to a teacher and she can explain things or you can try role-playing. It's a little difficult at first to speak to a robot on the computer screen, but once you get used to it, it can be helpful for practice.